Commercial law firms all over the world are increasingly called upon to advise clients wishing to do business or to invest in Africa. Clients entering into supply contracts in Nigeria, employing staff in Ghana, or leasing property in Lesotho need to understand local laws regulating their conduct. Equally, they need to know that if something goes wrong, their trusted legal advisors can navigate litigation and civil procedure in these jurisdictions. Unfortunately, high costs of production mean that access to the case law of many African jurisdictions is not available from traditional commercial publishers or is significantly out of date. Introducing the African Legal Information Institute, or African Lee, Africa's free online legal publisher. In partnership with the African Commercial Law Foundation, African Lee has an unparalleled quantity of commercially relevant court judgments available online from 16 African countries. So the project involved sourcing, selecting and summarising over 400 previously unreported cases from across South Africa, Ghana, Nigeria, Tanzania and Uganda. The primary purpose is to be able to provide access to this information for law firms both on the continent and internationally. Each judgment in the index is also accompanied by a short case summary, authored by top postgraduate law students from the University of Cape Town. The index fills an immediate gap identified by business people and legal practitioners on the ground in African countries. From Mozambique and other African countries, to get access to cases and access to legal principles and knowledge is very, very difficult. I've noticed that it's different to here in the UK where things are much easier to access. So this particular project is very important because what we did was we summarized all these, uh, all these cases, we tagged them so that they're linked to a particular topic that's of relevance and it'd be easier for someone to find it by just quickly searching and re quickly reading uh, it within 150 words to 250 words, so like a tweet basically, and just giving you a summary of what you need to know on something that affects in your business. So for example, if you want to know something about shareholding or directors or something to do with um, uh, financing a company, you just click on the link and you're able to quickly see that summary. And um, I think that's something that's going to be really, really helpful and a step in the right direction. Another benefit of the index is that it demonstrates to entrepreneurs and investors that emerging African economies are open for business to the rest of the world. So today international firms have really struggled to have access to up-to-date case law and the idea that the index will not only be supporting the rule of law across the continent but also providing that access um, for free to firms from my side, I, I really hope that that will drive greater engagement of law firms um, as they're advising clients and, and try to encourage more business to be done in the continent. The index also feeds into a larger goal of African Lee to promote the development of a uniquely African commercial jurisprudence. Um, uh, the tradition in Africa is that most of these countries, if not all except perhaps Ethiopia, have uh, developed um, a practice of reliance on the jurisprudence from their colonial masters. So it could be the uh, British jurisprudence, um, uh, Portuguese jurisprudence, or the French. Um, um, what we're seeing more and more with the introduction of African Lee is that African judges are relying on judgments by fellow judges. And we think this will even help to promote that uh, because the commercial um, law index uh, has developed a large body of jurisprudence, about 400 uh, cases involved in this from African countries, uh, which will um, try to uh, make it easy for researchers to see uh, what judgments on commercial law have been uh, decided in other countries and on what topics, and so they can rely on each other. The index is already making its mark in academic circles, where students from the University of Cape Town have been using it in their research. I, I use African Lee as a resource, mostly when I'm doing comparative uh, study or research, because it gives me um, an outline of other jurisdictions and what the law is in different jurisdictions so that I can compare and make uh, a persuasive argument on the cases I'm writing about. With this launch, African Lee and the African Commercial Law Foundation aim to build a community of legal professionals all over the world who are united by their interest in African commercial law and practice. Check out the index at www.africanlii.org forward slash commercial. You can get involved by suggesting new cases, topics or countries to be added to the index. Or find us on Facebook, Twitter or LinkedIn, 
where you can share your challenges and insights into commercial legal practice in Africa. The African Commercial Law Index, supporting economic growth and the rule of law across the African continent.